Hello again, this is part two of my Elite Entertainment LaserDisc collection, collection show-off. And right now on the table is George, George A. Romero's Night of the Living Dead. It's a 25th anniversary collector's edition in a gatefolded sleeve. And it has some pretty cool rare extras, actually. Um, it has a George Romero commentary a new transfer it has photos and trailers and advertising materials and everything and the complete script available on the disc it has liner notes by Stephen King Sam Raimi and Tom Savini it has um, scenes from lost Romero films like there's always vanilla and uh, which also is called the affair uh, and an ex a more ex even a more extensive still library of rare black and white color and color photos uh, and it has a brief uh, hello from George Romero it's a two disc version and inside you find this really nice a folded sleeve with a group photo and uh, everything like that. Very good looking. This is a THX um, edition, so it's been um, overhauled uh, in that way. And it has a classic, super f funny um, spoof of this movie, which is called The Night of the Living Bread. And if you haven't seen that, uh, please do. It's funny, super funny. And then we continue on to Dawn of the Dead in the boxed set version, uh, director's cut. Uh, another nice uh, box set and inside we have a um, insert like this with a letter from um, John Esposito who was co-producer on From Dusk Till Dawn and within this set you find among others you find a audio commentary by George A. Romero and by Tom Savini among others original trailers and television spots radio spot two alternative scenes from the argento zombie version or i think it's also called the european version and you have a shooting uh, script uh, on the disc itself you have the behind the scenes photos and production stills and posters and collectible stills on the um, discs and you also have fan testimonials uh, so a really great package continuing on we have the day of the dead there you go and it has a video journal of the making of and that's I think that's basically it really um, so nothing special other than that but still cool and then we have a Lustig film produ produced by Larry Cohen called Maniac Cop oh god you can't see that can you there you go Maniac Cop and this stars the great Bruce Campbell so this is a movie to get if nothing else than for that fact and this has some additional scenes for the Japanese television and it has some uh, television and uh, radio sp spots and that's basically it uh, no actually I'm way out there this also has commentary I never saw that this is commentary by William Lustig Larry Cohen, uh, Bruce Campbell, and Jay Chataway. Uh, so that's it uh, for this film.
And then we have a double feature of Mario Bava films. It has Baron Blood and Lisa and the Devil, which is contained on two discs. It has both have two theatrical trailers. And it has a letter from um, Alfredo Leone, who was producer on the films. And then we have a classic, Reanimator. Um, this is the 10th anniversary edition. And basically we have two full running audio commentary tracks by Stuart Gordon, Brian Usna, and the original cast. Over 20 minutes of additional R-rated footage, including a never-before-seen dream sequence, theatrical trailer, and television spots. Um, and this is from a new, um, new transfer. And it has a short letter, letter by um, Brian Yuzna, or Yuzna, whatever it is. However, you pronounce that. And this is Gatefold with a guide um, to the individual scenes. Um, because this has some uh, additional scenes, basically, so this tells you what's special about it. And now my last Elite Entertainment title in my incomplete library is Prom Night, which pairs together Jamie Lee Curtis and uh, and uh, Leslie Nielsen. So that's that's a weird couple. I never really liked this movie. I, I thought it was sort of a bit too uh, standard, perhaps. I don't know. And this only has television spots. Still, though, Elite Entertainment. Um, so that's basically it for my Elite Entertainment collection. Thank you for watching, and I'll get back to you soon with some new titles on on perhaps a less defunct uh, format next time. So thank you.